hey you guys um, quick video want to talk about DMT with you guys a little more so I'm talking about smoking pure DMT and um, the reason I want to talk about it is because I want some feedback from you guys about your personal experiences with um, DMT and what you think about fractals so <clears throat> I've had some very interesting experiences where um, the colors in one <laughs> in one situation the colors were like extremely sexual energy that enveloped my body and yeah that was a, a that was a hell of an experience then another one was like there were beings that were standing way far off in the distance it was not like I could really make them out but I was aware of them and then instead of the energy like the energy usually comes straight for you like this they'll come from the front that's been my experience well, this energy looped around and came around to the side. And what I noticed is that this particular energy had holes in it. So like you get the fractals and the colors that are dancing around. So instead of these, this color being solid or, you know, variations of that color, like uh, um, different hues of green or something like that, this one had holes all in it. And then it came around and it attached to my chest and then I felt like this sucking motion as if my energy was being sucked and depleted. So I immediately had to dismiss that and one of the lessons that my guys taught me was that you have to be conscious of energy at all times be it in the spirit realm or here on the planet because um, spirit beings and beings here on the planet will try to appear in a way that's acceptable to you in order to attach to you suck your energy or get what they need from you so that was um one experience then um recently um uh this was something else so i had i smoked to channel i was smoking to channel for someone so I can just release and let my guys come through or whatever guys needed to come through. And so I had at one point slumped down on the floor because um, I was transitioning to, I guess, another energy. And then I felt these energies off to the side that were like, um, <clears throat> like you feel sad, don't you? Like basically they were projecting sadness and everything to me and I wasn't sad. And they actually used a particular situation that I'm going through right now in order to um, bring about that sadness because I'm not happy about what's going on right now. And then um, my guys were like, absolutely not. They were like, you need to stay aware because I was almost at the point that I was ready to cry. And um, my guy stepped in and basically dismissed the energy. One more thing is that um, the fractals, when they, I've had them dance and move and come towards me. Um, and I'm talking about the ones that are like see-through and clear, but it looks like it's just a lot of lines, you know, to make up that particular form and basically like they try to attach to you in some kind of way like they try to just just caress your whole body like get into your energy for a particular reason and um my guys were like pay attention these are actually beings they're beings and when you see them you are actually in their world you're in their world you're visiting their space so they were like be conscious of that so what I've learned is this when I'm in DMT and um, I'm just observing there are times when I can just absolutely observe and of course there's a feeling that you feel of course when DMT hits you but what I've also learned that there's a distinction between when the other energies try to attach themselves to you pull your energy and things like that so this is kind of like a hey let me make you aware of this type of video but also i want some feedback from those of you who have also experienced this and were you really aware that your energy was being impacted and that you know that beings were that these fractals are actually beings and that they're trying to um you know test you out um so one of the guides came through i think it's so Ishtar channels through me and she said that um, what did she say these beings it's just like you know how if um, 
you see something that you've never seen before so let's say you see a plant and you and it's just extraordinary and you're like whoa look at this plant and like you just want to go and touch it and feel it and see you know what's the deal with this plant and um, she said that it's the equivalent when we go into their world they want to touch us they want to see us they want to kind of explore us like what is that energy hmm what is that let me test that one out so it's like that but at the same time you need to be conscious because there are so many I've encountered so many different types of beings and I just kind of want you guys to be aware of that but please 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 do tell what has been your experience and what do you think about this so love and light just to let you guys know I do do readings um, I do channel so if you're ever interested contact me on Facebook at Kijana Martin CO Kijana Martin company that's my um, Facebook page or you can always message me so love and light you guys take care I hope everything is going well in your life and Talk to you soon. Bye.